What's up everyone? I'm Connor Maynard. Make sure you check out my interview on Amaru Don TV. It is what it is. We all know that you've recently been in the States. Yes. Right. So when you was in, was it with Neo and Pharrell? Yeah. Was that your first time meeting them? Um, no, I mean, it was my first, it was definitely my first time meeting Pharrell, but uh, with Neo I'd actually met him um, just before I was signed, because um, when I did, I did a cover of a Beautiful Monster on YouTube and uh, he saw that and he uh, reached out like very early on before I was signed and I was, I was lucky enough to meet him in, uh, in London, in, in uh, the Mayfair Hotel in the penthouse suite at the top, he was just chilling in there, so he was like, yeah, just two years ago then. Yeah, 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 I that was, yeah exactly, that was a while ago, so he kind of took me out there and um, I was lucky enough to meet him. And uh, yeah, he told me he wanted to sign me, which is what actually started the buzz of me kind of eventually getting signed. Anyway, so um, yeah, I met him back then. But in terms of with Pharrell, I'd, I'd just um, done a, a showcase for uh, the label um, because I was, I was starting to do my live shows. Obviously, I was, I was kind of just showing them what I was planning to do. And then uh, they really liked it. And then the head of the label kind of came up to me afterwards. And the, well, the two kind of heads came up to me and they were like, oh, like, well, oh, well done. We're like, we're, we're, it's, it's amazing seeing your progress and it's really cool. And I was like, oh, thank you. And they're like, and then they kind of looked at each other and they were like, should we tell him? And I was like, what? They're like, should, should we tell him? And I was like, oh, come on, you got to tell me. And then um, they told me that Pharrell, the day before, I called the label um, asking if I was signed to them and saying he wanted to work with me in Miami. So, like, that was like a, a massive moment kind of thing to be like, wow. And I rang my brother and he was like, what? I want to come. <laughs> so, so, yeah, that was crazy. And then uh, I, I got over to Miami and I was trying to keep it, keep it cool because I didn't know whether I was going to get there. And he'd be like, oh yeah, I'm in with you this week. Or like, he'd be like, oh yeah, who, who are you again? Oh yeah, Connor, right, let's go, kind of thing. So I'd like, I'll keep my call, like, just in case he's a bit he's not too hyped at the beginning. <laughs> but I got in there, I'm, he was like more excited to meet me than I was to meet him, because I was trying to keep my call, and he was like, yo, man, kind of thing. He was, he was really cool, and he was kind of saying all these ideas he had. And he told me that when he actually initially reached out to work with me, it was, um, it was actually to sign me. He didn't realize I was already signed. <laughs> and when he saw the MTV uh, brand new thing, he then thought, oh wow. He might be signed, so he called up and said, "Is he signed?" And they were like, "Yeah." And he was like, "Damn!" And he thought, "Oh, whatever. I just I work with him. I work with him anyway." So, yeah, I spent a week in 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 Miami in the studio with Pharrell, and um, I think yeah, more famous people. I must have met more famous people in that week than my entire life. So, it was crazy. Yeah, I mean, uh, on my on the third day I was in there, uh, Ludacris rolled through, and um, he was he was there, and he was in the studio for one of the days, and then uh, Tyler the Creator came through the next day. And then, um, as, a, as like a kind of, I suppose like a farewell kind of thing, when I went uh, on the last day, Fro said to me, my manager, like, yeah, man, we're gonna go to the Tyler Creator concert together. So once that one, we went backstage, and then Lil Wayne was backstage as well. Yeah. So uh, it, was a, it was a fun, fun week. Yeah. And obviously, yeah, the Neo was the following week in LA, so yeah. it was that, yeah, that, really cool. Did you ever get a bit like starstruck, like, wow, like, Neo Wayne. Yeah, I mean, I think for me it's always a bit like, because oh, I've got to remember that I'm an artist as well. Yeah. So it's like, I'm an upcoming artist, I don't want to run in there like a fan, like, oh my god, I love you so much. <laughs> like, sign my face, kind of thing. I was trying to keep it kind of cool. Um, and yeah, no, I think that rather than like wasting my time kind of just screaming at them, rather than, it's kind of cool just to learn from them and like see what they think of the music. Because obviously when they were in the studio, Pharrell made a point of playing all kind of my tracks to them, see what they thought and what their advice was because you know they're in the game and they've been in it for a long time so it's uh, it was cool to hear what they had to say so yeah it was fun uh, but yeah time, times are definitely extremely busy I mean I, I kind of only use my house to sleep now it's just I get back, sleep, wake up, leave mm -hmm. so um, uh, yeah it, it's, it's not so like quick as a lot of people think obviously I, I signed a year and a half ago and it's only kind of building up now